Hello, welcome to Closet Coaching. I was talking to a client this week about the feeling she gets when, or got, when she put on a pair of shorts and felt that they were tighter. And what happened, like that sort of visceral flooding, which I, I call it a flooding, of like, <gasps> like you know, sort of this sense of panic and oh no, and fear almost, um... It could be anger for some people and like just this, this primal sense of panic, which is, you know, we should note, like that's because we have been conditioned to believe that weight gain and, um, you know, body size uh, is wrong and inherently wrong. And that's conditioned in us. But there is this visceral reaction that can happen when, when we notice that we have gained weight. And I think about this as rather when you when you feel that sense that like like feeling to think about it as your body just thinks you're in trouble and so it's sending you that panic on purpose as a protective that's sort of a an adaptive measure of like when there is trouble in our environment or when there when we perceive ourselves to be in danger your body is designed to incite like stress hormones that can help you if you need to run away or fight something like just from an evolutionary perspective that's why our stress hormones flood us with this adrenaline and this panic and this energy almost energy it is not almost it's energy that like can prepare you to deal with the threat at hand now that's a really old adaptive response but it still exists in our modern bodies and it's rooted in the fact that we perceive danger. We have conditioned ourselves to perceive weight gain as dangerous, but that's what we've done. And so seeing it like that, rather than buying into the panic and thinking, oh, I'm panicking, something's wrong, something's wrong, thinking of it more like my body has been conditioned to believe there is a threat and it is responding by telling me to be to be afraid, to be on guard, to it's, it's heightening our energy on purpose. It thinks it's protecting us. That's what it's designed to do. And when you can think of it like that, it can help you disarm from that feeling and stop identifying with that feeling so that you can say, okay, I know cognitively that there is no actual danger that requires this amount of energy and, you know, and response. I am not actively being threatened. And so I can go in and tell my body, no, no, it's okay. We, it's okay to calm down. I hear you're trying to help me out, but I got this. Um, And in that sense, you can have this conversation back with your body so you don't need to be kind of hijacked by this emotional flooding that's really an energy and a part of your nervous system bracing you for what's to come. Um, You can sort of inform it back. Um, And I think it's a really helpful way of, of thinking of that if that's something that you deal with.